Today, I'll be creating a player to break every NFL rushing record. But what is the record? Well, it's actually held by Cowboys legend Emmitt Smith. During his 14-year career, he ran for 18,355 yards. And that's not the only record we have to break. Because we have five more rushing records that seem impossible to break, but we're going for it. So in order to do this, I made a 99 overall running back that has maxed out stats everywhere. And I put him on the Buffalo Bills because the Bills are one piece away from winning the Super Bowl. And luckily for ourselves, our offensive scheme is vertical power run which fits perfectly with our player so let's see if in our rookie season we can make the playoffs and even win the super bowl and break the rookie rushing record which by the way is held by eric dickerson who ran for 1800 yards back in 1983 so it's been standing strong for 40 years wow what a season 16 wins and only one loss as a rookie we have a bye of course and we led the league with rushing yards with 2300 not only does that break the rookie record of 1800 but it also breaks the single season season rushing record of 2100 yards. We're off to a good start, but we just gotta be consistent in order to break Emmitt Smith's. Unfortunately, we were one touchdown short of tying the, the single season rushing touchdown record, uh, cause it's 28, we got 27, but I have a feeling in the future, we're definitely gonna break it. The fact that we ran for 136 yards per game is wild. And our longest yard, or our longest run, I should say, was 96 yards, tied with my boy, Christian McCaffrey. And just to confirm it, uh, right here in Madden, we are first Eric Dickerson and Adrian Peterson below us. And then my boy, Barry Sanders, who I personally think is the best running back of all time. I want you guys to comment down below, who do you think the best running back of all time is? I gotta go with Barry. And then LaDainian Tomlinson, that's the guy we gotta beat. We were one short. We're gonna break it. And by the way, Adrian Peterson with 296 yards, we could not break that. We're at 271, but hopefully, I mean, OJ Simpson, my, my guy, my, my, my boy, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He, uh, he, he, he uh, you know, Bill's legend. He ran for two more yards than us in the game. I was just kidding. I'm not, I mean, I think what he did was despicable, but if the glove don't fit, you know, it don't fit. Our first playoff game is against the Cincinnati Bengals. I'm only gonna hop into Super Bowl games. There's no point in playing if it's not the Super Bowl. So we're gonna simulate this game and see if we end up winning and we won 28 to 17. Yours truly ran for 118 yards, got two touchdowns, and now we're up against the Kansas City Chiefs. They won it in real life, of course. Can we beat Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift? I think we could do it. Fingers crossed, come on. EA, do not sell me. I gotta get to the Super Bowl, and wow. Oh my God, 48 to nine, we ran through him. Patrick Mahomes had a horrible game throwing three interceptions. Josh Allen threw perfect, man, five touchdowns. And we got 130 yards. We did our thing. And uh, hey, we are on to the Super Bowl against the Dallas Cowboys, who also crushed the Falcons. On paper, they're a better team than us, 89 overall. They have a good defensive line with Micah Parsons and Demarcus Lawrence, but I'm Dula. We're going to run right through him. So let's start by simulating the first few quarters. We're off to a great start. 7-0, 10-0. All right. I will jump in the fourth quarter. We're up 13-0, and they finally get a touchdown. And now in the second half, I kind of want to hop in. We start with the ball in the second half. We're doing a counter play to yours truly. Let's see if I can get some yards. That was a bad run. Wow. I'm just going to do straight coach suggestion. I'm not going to control it. I'm just going to have John Madden, you know, rest in peace. He's going to decide what we're going to do. You know, I see Stephon Dix, he's getting pressed. They have a safety and help. Oh, never mind. He's wide open. Throw it deep. Come on out. Boom. All the way. That should be a touchdown. That is light work, man. Next up on defense. Okay, they end up scoring a touchdown, so we're back on offense. Let's start with a little inside zone run. Micah Parsons, we got to watch out for him. Our blockers are doing their thing. Come on, juke move. We're straight. I just realized too, I'm wearing number 32. If I'm not mistaken, OJ Simpson wore that. So hey, we are, you know, we're making them. We're, I, I, I don't know, man. Oh no! We almost throw a pick. Now you see me personally, I never punt the ball on fourth down. And I think the future of the NFL is like that as well. So I had to run it and we got a first down. Second and eight, it's time to pass the ball. You could give it to me. I can catch the ball, but they're playing good defense. We got Stefan Diggs, dot him up. Let's go. RPO time, I'm handing it off. Handing it off, juke move, second and seven. I'm not sure where I wanna go. Am I open on the wheel route? No. Bad pass, Dula! I'm stupid, I'm selling. That's on me. I thought he was gonna go for a streak. That's on me. Or a slant, that's on me. I sold. Well, hopefully they don't score. Okay, they don't score back on defense. We get the ball back, we got blessed. I can't make no more mistakes, all right? Give me a big run. Get that block, let's go. Juke move. Oh, he, he, they're pressing. They're pressing like crazy. Stefan Dix on the streak. Come on. Beat him off the press. Yes, sir. 
Not again. Wide open, Diggs. Oh, I overthrew it. It is all good. Third and five, that slant should be wide open. But if not, yours truly, fourth and one. Ah, I don't know. Is it up to me? I'm gonna go for it. This may be stupid, but I'm going for an outside zone run. Maybe a horrible idea. Will our blockers? Yes, let's go, big run. That middle looks wide open. That middle looks so open for me to attack. Good blocking, cut back in, cut out. Easy first down, baby. Slip screen on third and six. I've yet to try a screen play. We get open, give me them blocks. Yes, left side's open. Juke them out, that's big. I like what I see across the middle. I think Diggs or Gabe Davis. I think Davis. I think Gabe Davis, got him! Touchdown, baby! Will they score? Mm, yeah, they get a field goal, but hey, we're up by 11. I'm pretty sure that we have just won the Super Bowl. Yes, sir, we do in our rookie season, bro. The Buffalo Bills win their first Super Bowl in this era. It's about time for Josh Allen, man. The question is, will I get MVP? Will this man right here get MVP? I guess we'll find out in the offseason, but this game I had 120 yards, one touchdown, did my thing. And I wonder, can I win like Offensive Rookie of the Year, Offensive Player of the Year, and a Super Bowl MVP all in one season and break every record? And the answer is yes. We won Super Bowl MVP, Offensive Player of the Year, and Offensive Rookie of the Year off to the best start possible. Bro, this is what I'm talking about. We are on pace to break all these records, bro. Well, year number two, we have five years remaining on this contract and it's actually like not, not really well. It's not a good contract. Only $5 million a year. We're getting severely underpaid. And I think it's time we give him some superstar abilities, make him even more OP so which one should we add to him he gets anything I feel like bruiser or, yeah bruiser would be a good one evasive or human joystick ah I'm gonna go with evasive and we'll finish it off with this where he gets uh, his fatigue it doesn't really get impacted at all that will give him more you know carries more yards more touchdowns I'm thinking you know 3d chess over here also we should try to get seven uh super bowls we should try to break the super bowl record while we're at it too i mean we have a stacked team damn crazy enough we only finished 12 and 5 and now we're tied with the dolphins 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 in the wild card game but it's all good another season of us leading the league in rushing yards but only 21 touchdowns this time around Ah, uh, we kind of fell off a bit. I don't know what's going on. I, I I think it's because we had less carries. Like, yeah, 279 compared to Derrick Henry, who had almost 50 more carries than us. But like I said, I'm only hopping into Super Bowl games, so we're going to simulate to the next week. Cross our fingers. It's the Dolphins, bro. We should beat them. We beat them 24-17. We're up against the Bengals, who are also 12-5, and five, so a whole lot of 12-5 and five teams. But again, we have two stacked of a roster for it to even be a contest, and... We beat them 42 to 27. Ah, we should probably hop into this one because the Chiefs are 16 and one. They came back with the vengeance because their guy, Rashi Rice, he came back with an 88 overall. So he improved like crazy. So let's see, starting off this ball game, Kansas City scores right away. We come back down the field, we don't score. In the first half, we get a field goal. And all right, still simming, we finally got a lead. All right, fourth quarter's here. I think now would be a good time to jump in. We're up 17-14, and we get the ball back. Here we go. Third and three. You know what time it is? I got my superstar X-Factor ability. I'm going to run in. Easy first down. We got a read option play. Ah, L blocking. Remember, I do have evasive and all those fire abilities, so I'm going to use my advantage here. And we got a first. Ah, third and inches. We're going for a deep pass here on third and inches. Maybe not the best idea. Oh, yeah. Circle is wide open. Let's go, Gabe Davis. Let's keep on running, man. Up the middle. Up the middle. Yeah, good blocking. Finding those holes all the way to the touchdown, baby. Hey, man. What can I say? That's what I do. The Chiefs, will they end up scoring? Come on, Kansas City. Put up a good fight. Nope. We got the ball right back. Here we go. Handoff play to the right. Good block. Yeah. Yeah. Play action. Who's open? I'm open. I might as well. Oh, that's not even me. Don't know who bro is. But I'm pretty sure if we sim the rest of this game, we should be straight. And we end up crushing them. 31-14. We are headed back to the Super Bowl, man. And this time around, we're up against the Los Angeles Rams. Should be an interesting matchup here. But here we go. Playing at SoFi Stadium. Starting off by scoring an easy touchdown. They come right back. Oh, we score quick as well. We got ourselves a ball game. And we got the job done easily, 31-17. No need to hop in, man. That was light work. We are back-to-back -back Super Bowl champions. We ran for 106 yards, two touchdowns, 
we could also get an MVP two times. And that's exactly what happened. We won our second Super Bowl MVP and Isaiah Pacheco took our Offensive Player of the Year. It is what it is, man. We are starting as good of a career as you can get. Year number three, we finished with a 13 and four record, but we're still in the wild card game. And as expected, we lead the league again and we actually broke a new record, 28 rushing touchdowns. Actually, nope, we tied it. We tied it with LaDainian Tomlinson. That's tough, we still haven't broke it yet, but we're on the right track, I guess. I need more carries. If I got more carries, I, this would be way higher. Let's say the average running back has a 10 year career. I think, you know, 10 years of averaging 2000 yards, we're on track unless we get injured or, you know, something catastrophic happens. But I'm gonna send him to the Super Bowl and I'm gonna hope we have a chance to three-peat. I don't know who else has three-peated in NFL history. My knowledge doesn't go back that deep. The fact that the Chiefs went back to back is, is crazy alone, but are we gonna three-peat? Wolverine, what you think, bro? Oh, okay, he's up, oh, never mind. Yes, we're going back to the Super Bowl against the Cowboys again. Starting off, we have the lead, but it's a back and forth game, man. They could easily take it from us in, I don't know, hold on. We got it back. If they score here, we should hop in. Oh, now we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, shoot, okay, we're up by three with 47 seconds left. They're onside kicking it, and they have three timeouts. Can we grab it? Yes, we got the ball, that's huge. So now, we need a first down, and that should be game. Halfback dive with the man himself, Dula, across the middle, good blocking. Hey, can we get some more? Can we get some more? Hey, make a miss, yeah, all the way. Dula, touchdown, baby. And just like that, that's that's wrap, that's a wrap right there. We have yet again won another Super Bowl against the Cowboys. I ran for 140 yards and had two touchdowns again. Season recap, our third Super Bowl MVP, our second offensive player of the year. I think we solidified ourselves as one of the best top three running backs of all time, but we still have so much work to do to even cross, you know, 10,000 yards. Shout out to Frank Gore, very satisfying number, 16,000 on the dot. But this year, I wanna make sure we can cross this LaDainian Tomlinson record. And to do that, to make it easier, I'm gonna change the frequency to lower. Of, of, of our running back being substituted out that way we have more time on the field now this could backfire because uh the lowest you could do is it could backfire because i could get injured and just miss out on a whole lot of games so it is kind of risky but i guess the strategy was smart because we finished out 15 and 2 and we demolished our previous record with 2400 yards 32 touchdowns so boom two records broke we broke our own record and 32 rushing touchdowns we still didn't get that many more carries to be honest but the next best running back is like 600 yards less than us, that's crazy. Imagine we have a whole career of winning a Super Bowl every single season. The way it's looking, we might do it. Yup, back at it. Bro, this is like the Cavs and Warriors, but for football. And here we go. These are always good, close matchups. It's not like we've been dominating them every time. Like, it, it might come down to the wire. It's close, none of us are scoring. Finally put something on the board. And, oh yeah, that's, that's it. That's a wrap. We end up winning. Wait, 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 whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta punt it. Fourth and seven, they have no timeouts left, but they could still get a miracle play, you never know. Let's just spectate and see what they do. First and 10 from their own 17 yard line. Will Dak Prescott throw up a Hail Mary? Yeah, he's going deep, wait a minute. No, nope. on the run, getting sacked, fumble, pick it up, yo, pick it up. That's it, that's game. We ran for a cool 136 and got three touchdowns this time and another Super Bowl MVP to add to our trophy collection and another Offensive Player of the Year. I do want to get MVP. I know it's really tough for a running back to do it, but we should, we should try to aim for it at least. You know, Mahomes is he's obviously the GOAT. But I wonder at what age will we fall off? Like, will it happen next year in a couple years? Or are we always going to be putting up these stats? You never know with running backs. Ah, first time not making the Super Bowl, man. Super Bowl 62 is Eagles and the Ravens. You hate to see it. Hey, it was about to happen. Another concerning thing was that we only ran for 1,900 yards this season, like a huge fall off. So hopefully it does not get worse from here. We're only four years in. We cannot fall off already. I'm about to take this auto sub thing to the extreme and make sure they never sub out and see it, either if my guy ends up dying on the field or he breaks every record by a mile. Let's find out. Also, this is his last season on this contract, so he might find a new team afterwards, so we gotta go all out this year. Honestly, I wondered, I expected a lot better, but I mean, 2,200 yards, 30 touchdowns, that's cool, I guess. It still is record at the end of the day. Also, that puts us second so far, right behind Emmitt Smith for most rushing touchdowns in their career. We're obviously gonna crush that one. It's just the yards that I'm not sure about because currently, we're not even in the top 10 just yet, but 18,000 is a lot and things can happen. 
And once again, we do not make the Super Bowl. This is not good. So moment of truth, Sims to the next season, where will I be taking my talents to? Or will I be back in Buffalo? We're still contenders, don't get it twisted. Moment of truth, I'm about to click NFL rosters. Are we still on the team? Yes, we are on the team and we're getting paid a bag. There we go. Contract looking like this, four years and our total salary is 52 million and our bonus is 39 million. So each season we're making about 20 million buckaroonies, man, I'll take it. Oh yeah, by the way, Stefan Diggs left us. That might be a reason we haven't been making it to the Super Bowl, but Gabe Davis is still solid and uh, Dalton Kincaid. It would be fire if we stay on this team our entire career, you know, kind of like Emmitt Smith, just be with one team, you know, like Curry and them and build a legacy the best RB of all time. All right, so quick update. We are in year number eight, right? We're 28 years old, you know, maxed out. We've had great seasons. And I actually am surprised. We are at 19,270 yards, 226 touchdowns. And uh, we actually got the longest run of 99 yards, which is the longest you could do in NFL history, obviously. A field is 100 yards, you know. And we only played 150 games, right? Will we smash Emma Smith's record, bro? Almost by over 1,000. And we still have so many more years to do it because Smith did it in 14 years. We're only in year number eight. So I want to see how high we can run it up. Also with rushing touchdowns, 226 so the last thing i want to see actually is this the single game rushing record and single game td record because that's the toughest one i actually don't think it shows that i don't think you could find that record specifically um yeah we don't have any games here for 200 yards dang it i wish i could check but if i go to career stats it just shows yeah it just shows longest run but not most that's so tough, man. Damn. I don't think we broke the six touchdowns in the game because that was unreal that Elvin Kamara did that. But at this point, I'm going to just simulate to the end of his career and I want to see how many yards does he end up finishing off with in touchdowns. So I'll see you guys then. And here we go. Officially retired as a Oakland Raider, by the way. Or no, not Oakland. Bro, I'm... Wow, Oakland. Las Vegas Raider, my fault. Uh, after 15 seasons, so we played one more year than, than Emmitt Smith himself. Let's see what number we finish out at. Damn, 31,921 total rushing yards over 15 seasons. That's actually crazy. Uh, almost doubling Emmitt Smith. And then for rushing touchdowns, 361. And Isaiah Pacheco actually finishes second, which is pretty interesting. And then for a season, most rushing yards, we ended up doing that numerous times, by the way, even in our last season, 2,400 yards, uh, three times in our career, which is insane. And then rushing touchdowns in the season, 32, 30, we did our thing. And in a single game, rushing yards, we could not break that one. That sucks. Adrian Peterson with 296, we only get to 273. We couldn't even beat OJ Simpson. And even rushing touchdowns in the game, um, you know, Kamara was six, and the most we got was five, which is still solid. But damn, if you guys want to see me do this with wide receiver, let me know. I actually did the same exact video with quarterback. Check it out right here. But uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys soon, man. Peace.